This is how we know Brian Koberger is the killer. At 2.44 and 2.53 a.m. November 13, 2022, a vehicle matching Koberger's white Elantra is spotted in southern Pullman, Washington. At 2.47 a.m., Koberger's phone is turned off in the same area. At 3.26 a.m., that same vehicle is spotted near 700 Indian Hill Drive in Moscow, Idaho, heading north. It's then spotted two minutes later at 3.28 a.m. at the intersection of Steiner and State Highway 95, missing its front license plate. Front license plates are not required in Pennsylvania, where Koberger is from. According to the probable cause document, the same vehicle arrived in the area of 1122 King Road at around 3.29 a.m. and makes three initial passes, which are all caught on surveillance cameras. We can see this white Elantra on leaked surveillance footage, and it matches the PCA perfectly, including turning around twice and completing four passes. The final pass ends at 4.08 a.m. This is when Koberger entered the house and killed all four victims. Koberger's DNA was found on the snap of the K-Bar knife sheath near Madison Mogan's body. At 4.20 a.m., Koberger's white Elantra speeds away. Only 28 minutes later, Koberger turns his phone back on near Blaine, Idaho, and his phone is tracked all the way back around to Pullman, where at 5.25 a.m., it's spotted on Johnson Avenue. Brian Koberger is the killer.